This video is sponsored by PokeTownStore.com, the place for all your Pokemon TCG online needs. This is a fantastic website if you want to start your online uh, collection or if you're just looking for a specific code. Look at all these code cards that they offer. Definitely check it out, PokeTownStore.com and use the coupon code ZAPDOSTCG for 5% of your next order. Also, this video is sponsored by CardMarket.com. If you're a European player, you're obligated to check out this website. You can sell your own cards or purchase from people all across Europe so this is a fantastic platform I use it personally every day and let's uh, for example check out this boss's orders you can see in time when the price is right and get notified when it has, has a specific amount of money so uh, at this point three euro and 28 cents for a boss's orders what a bargain sale right here so definitely check out both of my sponsors you'll definitely uh, help me out with that a lot What's up YouTube, it's Zapdos TCG here and welcome back to our TCG booster opening on my channel. People were suggesting that I open more products so uh, that's exactly what we're gonna do here. So here we have Zacian V. It's very good that the Pokemon company decides to actually release very good promo cards, for instance the Zacian V. Also products like the, the Danny uh, Trainer Toolkit is good as well as the Picaram League Battle Deck. So uh, it's very fantastic for new players to get into the game these days which is awesome. We have the Zacian 10, uh, that's also available as a Zamazen. Ten, a Galar Legend with uh, Steely Resolve. So uh, that's gonna be interesting to see. I don't know which packs are in here, so uh, this is brand new. We're gonna be opening it up and hopefully we'll get some good pull ratios from a tin like this. I think back in the days, tins had four booster packs. I think nothing has changed um, since that. So let's just open that one up. You also get the TCGO code card and uh, I'm actually going to be giving away that TCGO code card on the screen right here so if you're one of the first viewers be sure to get your TCGO uh, ready and uh, up and running so you can actually redeem the code instantly. So uh, we're going to get the code cards for last so you guys already know people that watch the entire video will be rewarded. Maybe you skip to the last part you never know but the code card will be shown in this video as a little bit, a token of appreciation. If you're looking for more TCGO code cards be sure to check out Poke downstore.com and uh, also if you're looking for physical cards aka boosters uh, or just cards in general uh, and if you're from Europe be sure to check out cardmarket.com so we have two rebel clash one sword and shield and what the hell is this doing in here evolutions this is not even in the standard format I think it rotated out like two uh, seasons ago which is insane they are still getting rid of their old school evolution packs and just putting in uh, in these tins which is ridiculous so we have this fantastic Zation. Hopefully, I'll be able to get it out without actually bending the card. Oh, yeah, it's going out very quickly. So, uh, very nice condition. As you can see, Zation V being available as a promo card does help out because I do think uh, Zation ADP is still a viable deck after rotation. Because, of course, you can use Alter Creation Jacks of ADP to help out Zation V to smack even more damage. And Trepid Sword is probably one of the most busted abilities we've seen in a long while. Being able to just uh, use the card to draw cards, but also have energy cell by its side so very very nice card indeed so Zation V is the promo card and then we're gonna have four booster packs let's start off with this fun one Venusaur uh, yeah a Venusaur this is gonna be just such a nostalgic trip because this is evolution okay also uh, yeah for you guys that are watching here is the evolution code card scan it in or do whatever uh, let me know what you got all right, uh, I think the card trick is one, two, three, then one, two with these kind of packs. I don't know, we'll see. We have uh, a seal. Look at the old school artwork. Doesn't it remind you of back in the days of base set? Wow, this is so nostalgic. Seal, oh, magic card with flail. Nothing has changed about this card. A lightning energy, yes, lightning power. Old school one, evolutions, Caterpie. Oh yeah, the artwork is so familiar. Ghastly. I think back in the days they had like 30 HP. Also free retreat if I'm not mistaken. Could be wrong, but that's how I remember it. Energy Retrieval, which is uh, still a legal card uh, because it got reprinted in Sword and Shield, so we can still use this. Hooray! And then there's a Nidorino, which actually decided to change types. A funny fact about the Pokemon trading card game, the Poison type has been changed three times already. In the past, it was Grass types, like this Nidorino it also used to be a Grass type. Then they changed it up, I think, around the era of Diamond and Pearl, going to the uh, Psychic type. And now with Sword and Shield, they are uh, yeah, Darkness types. So very uh, cool fact of the day, a double Carlos Energy. So this is actually not a bad uh, evolution spec. As soon as DCE gets reprinted once again, I know they will do 
do it at one point. I, I, at one point, we actually had to wait 10 years for a DCE reprint, but it's a very busted card nevertheless. Ooh, look at this. Machamp, Break, and the rare is Ductry. Okay, I did the card trick right, so... In the times uh, of evolutions, they had break cards, which you can actually put on top of your Pokemon and uh, use these attacks. So you actually gain additional uh, attacks. I think the only uh, good ones are like Yanmega break as well as the Greninja break. Who could forget about Greninja break, right? So we actually pulled something legit. The DC is also nice. So that was actually very fun exploring that. Okay, moving forward, we're gonna be having an, a Rebel Clash. Rebel Clash, yeah, we're just gonna go with Sword and Shield first. You never know, maybe we pull an authorization. I've seen uh, Stranger Things happening, so uh, the Machamp break, very interesting. One, two, three, and now it's time with the energies. Yeah, that's where we are. With Sword and Shield, they always give you the energies. Mm, this is a Psychic type. I'm gonna be putting that Duck Trio to the side. Let's see here. Okay, there's a Grookey. There's Shelder. My wild. Galarian Ponyta. There's Sobble. This actually saw some play and lots of Intellion lines in certain decks. Salazzle. I, they think, I always think like, Salazzle, are you back again? It's, it seems to be printed in almost every set. Metal Saucer is very good. Going directly with that Zacian V, of course. Rotom Bike, not the best item card in the world. There's Galarian Meowth as a reverse. And the rare is Drampa. Don't think I've ever seen this Drampa. <laughs> okay, just a regular rare. You can actually use Twin Energy to smack 80 damage. Maybe in Twin Energy decks this could be tacked in, but I am not too sure about it. Okay, I don't think I've seen the... Yeah, here's the code card for Short and Shield. Let me know what you guys got with, of course, this uh, single pack sword and shield. Moving forward, here is a Rabo Clash with the Rillaboom V Max on the cover. Actually, Rillaboom was viable thanks to the sword and shield Rillaboom being able to accelerate energies. There's a lightning energy. So, we already got two lightning energies in three packs. Is it a sign? Who knows? Look at this beautiful Caterpie. It can evolve on the first turn you play it. Barboge, Aracuda, Stuffle, Lotad, Beware of the Beware. <laughs> Flip a coin if has discarded your opponent's active Pokemon. Hmm. Triple Accelerated Energy. Maybe you have other accelerations like Tapu Koko Prism Star. Having the Tangled, Tangled Glimwood or whatever stadium card that lets you reflip could be very interesting. Speed Lightning Energy. Very good card. Lots of lightning. Pelipper, very good card. We get it as a reverse. I love playing with reverse uh, special energies and trainers, so this is definitely awesome. Speed, lightning energy, and the rare is Seismic Toad. So, not too shabby. Okay, hopefully the last pack will contain like an ultra rare. We already got that Machamp break, but that does not actually count as an ultra rare. Here's also the uh, code card from Rebel Clash. Let me know what you got. Okay, this is the last booster pack for today. Hopefully you guys had a blast watching me opening up these uh, fantastic tin. All right. One, two, three, and the energy is grass. Okay. Two lightnings, a grass and a psychic. Those were the energies. We have Binacle, cool looking artwork. There's Galarian, Jarumaka. Look at this Vulpix. Milkery or Milsery, I don't know how it is pronounced. I say Milkery. <laughs> Galarian Farfetch'd, Metapod, there's a Heliolisk, a Burning Scarf, which we'll never see play, unfortunately. Bunnelby Reverse and the rare, bam, is Garboder. Okay, this Garboder actually saw some play with Toxtricity V Max and actually poisons the opposing, po opposing, <laughs> opposing Pokemon in the active slot, which could be helpful. So not the greatest of tins, but I actually enjoyed myself and that is the most important part. You guys hopefully uh, got the uh, ento ja ento <laughs> the very uh, crazy vibes from this video. Here we have another code card. I'm very excited by the way. Uh, I don't know why that is. Yo, you get this code as well. Now the last code card I'm giving away is this one, the Zation. Yeah, hopefully you guys had a couple of these code cards. If they're already redeemed, that means you're a little bit late to the party, but I'll be opening up more stuff very, very shortly. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to mouse the like button, subscribe for more content, and I'll be seeing you guys 
in the next video very shortly. We have lots of competitive uh, videos planned for you, so hopefully you guys are stoked. Anyhow, see you guys in the next video. Peace out.